Hey, welcome back to another week with uh, Learning with Luke. Today I'm going to have a guest, guest speaker, um, Corey, who's, uh, who works here with me. We're going to be kind of discussing a little bit uh, different than what you're used to. We're going to talk about software that helps you with uh, um, additive manufacturing design, right? Um, so a lot of times you want to make your parts lightweight. Um, you, you need to redesign for, for additive manufacturing for 3D printing. So let's introduce Corey to you guys, and uh, we'll, we'll look at some uh, cool videos. Thanks. Hey guys, this is Corey with CATI Simulation. I'm here to talk to you about uh, the So System product, functional generative design. Right, so let's go uh, take a look at the video. I'll show you a little bit more of what the software can do for you. So what we've got here are some very powerful tools that can help you take your additive manufacturing game to the next level. You can see here we're going to take this bracket and optimize it for 3D printing all within the software. So one of the first things we want to do is we want to go in, we want to define the envelope that we can work within. And you can see here it's a lot larger than the original part. And then we can go in, we can define the areas that we don't want to optimize, the mounting points, any of the functional areas of the part. And then we can apply physics, materials, we can define bolt loads, and then we can also tell it how we want to optimize the part, whether it's for weight savings or strength, etc. So now it's time to optimize the shape. Once we hit the go button, it does a topology optimization. As you can see, it kept all of the areas of the part we didn't want to optimize intact. And then it comes back and even lets us do a small little FEA so we can review the parameters and see if it's where we want it to be. And if not, we can tune it and get it to be just right. So once we've optimized the part, now we can go and clean it up. As you can see, it looks kind of like a chicken bone. That's the mesh result from the optimization. So you can go in and very easily smooth out the surfaces, make it look more like a production part. And then of course this is symmetrical so you can symmetry it over. Another really cool function is the lattice generation that you can do to help you lightweight the part even more wherever you can afford to have the structure with a lattice inside. And then you can also do internal lattices within the part within the skin. These areas won't be visible in the finished part, but will definitely help you make a lightweight, structurally sound product. So far, we've talked about optimizing your part for 3D printing or additive manufacturing. The other option is to optimize the part for machining, casting, variable sets of physics. So as you can see, these very powerful tools from Dassault can definitely help you optimize your 3D printing process. Hi guys, thanks so much for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. As always, you can visit us at uh, CATI.com. Uh, you can shoot me an email at builtpart uh, at CATI.com. See you guys next week. Take care. Bye.